Okay, today's base is coming up. Ooh, we can see it through the cloud layer. I hope I can. It looks night as usual, but there's nothing unusual about that. Right, which one do I want? Um, I don't know. I'll go for that one. Let's land on that one. So, Just You and Me, Kid, by George Lucas Lied. So, we're going to wait for uh, daylight while we're here. Okay, daylight has a rizzard. A rizzard. Right, have a look over the edge. Uh, so, it's got a couple of buildings around it. So, there's a couple of uh, bits of uh, pieces you can recollect. Just got to run away and come back again. Um, so there's another one over there as well. That's not bad, is it? It's pretty good. Uh, hello, I've seen that ship somewhere before. Uh, so that flight deck over there is held up by circular buildings or round ones at least. I don't think there's any way in them. It doesn't look like they're being used for anything, just uh, support. I don't know what the support is on this. Just have a look. Uh, the support under this one is um, <laughs> some poles in the middle. I like the middle bit, the depots on there, they're good. <laughs> That's clever. Um, they go off to further and the pumps. Hmm, look like minerals. Okay. Back. We're back. Let's go to the first route. Um, the, the buildings do have names. There's two buildings here. I don't know which one's which. I'm hoping there'll be like a, um, you know, a message or something like that to say what they are. So coming in, oh well we've got the base. We'll take the base computer because we need the address. Okay, address gotted. Uh, we have, we'll do that on the way back I think because it looks like uh, uh, coming round. So we've got some trees or little bushes circulating, circumventing the, uh, <laughs> circumventing, circum on the circumference of the build, the base terminus portals there, uh, with a couple of seats. Do they go look good? They are a sit seat. So we're going to sit. Where should we sit? This one? We'll have a good building. Oh, yeah, that handsome chap. Good job his face is covered. Right, so. Alright, well. Okay. There's E. Let's go. Good. Sitting under an awning. Oh, damn. Too swingy too much. We've got a message module. And the message is that's still not working. Yeah. They went offline for a while. <laughs> they obviously haven't fixed it on the last update either, so there we go. I'll have to print out uh let me just get the names. Right, there they are. Carrying on them, looking uh, kind of leftish. Oh, I like that. It's kind of <laughs> actually. What's that? What is that? It's a metal wall or something like that. Is that a metal wall? But it actually looks like a pool. <laughs> That's clever. Okay. Um, oh, ouch! Somebody hit me. Yeah, unless he's in there. Oh, he's just there. I can just see the spikes. Hang on. There was no hit points there, so it's not even touching it. So we'll just uh, keep you trapped in there for a bit. <laughs> Thanks. Could have put a warning on there, a big warning sign. <laughs> a big danger. Uh, okay, so we're looking along the wall here. Uh, we got some selenium. Doesn't look like a hot planet. We got some uh, gamma weed and uh, star brambles. I'm trying to remember what they're called. And behind the chairs, we have solar vine, selenium. Okay, carrying on. We're going let oh no, there's still the chairs there, so there's no point going down there. Right, so we got the first entrance in here. There's a bit of a plinky plonky music going on. I mean, they're a great idea, but 
<laughs> I haven't got, I'm not musical either, so I don't do them either. Uh, we got the kitchen by the look of it. Have a look what's in here. Yeah, it looks like a kitchen, an oven, although something's on the move. And pots, they look like they're actually on there. Uh, hot? I don't know. We got the uh, usual condiments and woks and microwaves and probably fridges in this case. I know they're not really fridges, but you've got to use them for something. Going left is a small, oh, the bedroom. The small room. Hello, small room. Definitely a small room with a bed. I'm not going to bother turning the music off, I guess that's what that's for. Um, in here is... It could be like a... Loo? Hmm. Sink. Uh, a bog, <laughs> I guess. Um, and I'm guessing that's trying to pretend to be a... Shower. Plenty of space for the air to get out. Okay, space. So I'm guessing they're supposed to be towels and um, a lot of talcum powder. <laughs> what? Well, you need to walk in here apparently. I don't know why, but it's weird. Okay, out of there then. That's that room. So that's back to here. Well, not back to here. We're in the other end of the room. Uh, it's going a bit dark, could have done with a bit more light in here. But my computer always seems to want to show it darker than it actually is. So sometimes I struggle when I review the film, it looks fine. <laughs> nah, my bad, never mind. Okay, so as you can see there is lights, but not for my liking enough. Uh, he's got a shortwave radio on the telly. On the cooker, on the stove, maybe? I don't know. Yes, yeah, stove, and it's a log fire type thing. And a couple of troughs. You know, for when he doesn't want. when he feels like he's going to be eating messily. Uh, this is a nest of tables. That's nicely joined. Um, I like that. Nicely joined tables. They're good. Let's have a look. Where were we? Where were we? Going back down again. We're still headed left. Uh, we've got the next entrance, I guess, is a big table. That's the uh, eating out section, is it? Yeah, table eat outside. What do they call it? Oh, al fresco. Yeah, let's go eat al fresco. I think that's a stupid word. Right, there it is. Uh, picture, nicely structured, easily, can't get lost, as I usually do. Then we got the base computer and a teleport. We might as well say the teleport as we're here. Um, can't tell which way that's going, but I reckon it must be down. Okay, yeah, down on the planet's surface. Is it just a way of getting onto the planet's surface? Hmm. No, I'll just take a quick look round. I can't see anything that way. Um, there's a circular thing that's holding the flight deck up with. Let's go that way. Might be able to look what's... Oh, um, see a pile of lights here, what's there? Um, <laughs> electric wire fence. <laughs> okay, so there's a hole. Well, I guess we're going in, are we? It might be something important down there. We don't know. We'll have a look. Yes. I do. Oh, wait. It extends this away. Hmm. That's a big cave. Could have had a cave base here. 
got vortex cubes. That is huge inside. Yeah, that's rather large. Where we can get such a big base in here. We just go further on down round, so we'll uh, quickly look over the crest of this hill. And uh, well, it's quite spacious. <laughs> you might be able to build something out of that. I'd put my um, all my transport pads in, I think I would. My base, I've got one in a base at one of mine, so I got them all in there. <laughs> Luckily for me, there was a puddle at the bottom, so I put the submarine in there as well. However, let's get out. We'll cut out. The, uh, I don't know which way we came in. We came in the hole, but I do think this is it. Okay, we're down. We're around and out. Oh, I just fall back fucking down again then. Okay. Let's get out. Do that again. Pretend that didn't happen, please. Okay, we're up. Right, so there's the... Better look see if there's any holes first. As I walk around, I won't fall in. Right, there's the round one. As you can see, it has no entrance. It's just um, a really great cylindrical holding the flight deck up. There's the other one. The poles. And they go off to this. Stop running. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you tell them. Right. So, into his, um Oh, a little bit of a build there. He's bunged the things on top. What's in there? Cobalt. And definitely mining cobalt. There seems to be a door. Oh, the batteries and the solar panels. Well hidden, because they're bloody ugly, aren't they? When you think about it, they're ugly as hell. Right, let's have a look at this, see how much we got. Um, it's using half. That's pretty good going. Half. Okay. Now we're going to get back round. Well, we're going to walk round. We'll just get. Oh, didn't want to scan. Get that way. I'm going to get round to the other side. And I think the. There it is. We go back up then. There wasn't anything else down there. Right. Up we golly well go. Weems up. Weems out. Right, so the next part of the build. Remember, I don't know which one's which, but. I'm not going to name them verbally, just in case I'm wrong. Uh, this is a big build, big, big. Um, this is another kitchen, some sort of preparation place. Oh, so, well, it's got woks and fans above it, so I'm guessing that's like a cooker. Again, probably fridges. And it's a boardroom. Big boardroom. That's using that same plate as the puddle in it. There's a swimming pool. Yeah, looks like it. Right, so that's out of there. Here's the other message module. I'm sure it would have told us the name, but they haven't worked in a while, so. Okay, out. Confronted with two fires. As if one isn't enough. Uh, we've got a big flat screen TV. Huge. Don't know what the pixel rate is, but there you go. Um, we've got a seating room to sit and watch telly. As if anybody's got any time to watch telly. There's a save point, obviously. And a little electric cubey blue. Blue cube. Okay. Uh, we might as well go over here first. Uh, gamma weeds, that's nicely two tiered. Quite a bit of gamma weed there. Uh, we got 
what, sunbeds? <laughs> he says just as the sun went in. And a fish tank, just to keep them warm. There's fire on the other side. Who knows that? But there you have it. Get up here. A uh, piece of, well, it's like a piece of modern art in the middle of the room. Lovely. Um, some plantage. There's some more up there. Star brambles. And he's got a little clock alarm for, you know, it's a huge bed. That's quite a good bed. Um, and he's got a coffee maker for the morning. I'm <laughs> just surmising, I don't know. Um, okay, so minding the sculpture, which I seem to be stuck on. There we go. So this room, it's a shame the triangles didn't fit in there. But then again, it would block the view somewhat. So I can understand two different ways of that. But there you go, one big slidey roof. Again, it's gone dark. We've been travelling around this bloody thing for ages. All day. Oh, I can't get out there. Oh, where's the damn exit? Oh, exit. Comes out this side, onto the other landings, landing platform. So the roof has two angles. I like this roof. It's just a shame we didn't have pieces to fit there. There. But that is um, good. I like that. That's not bad, actually. So, there you have it. And that leads us back to my ship. Oh, I nearly missed then. Right, and we will see you later. Ta-ra!